We are the mountaintop speaking. When we fan out across this city, and had so many people that just came up to me and said, I'm from Appalachia. I grew up in those mountains, and those mountains remain in me. We will go back to our neighborhoods in New York. So many of them have that complexity of that independent shop, that neighborhood that we love, damaged by the financing. Oh, this, this bank. And so many of our shops kicked out by these chain stores. That's fundamentalism. But it's no fun. Because what is fun and what feels like that enriching, complex question of a good spiritual life? That mountaintop that we have in a healthy, alive neighborhood. That complexity that we feel. Amen, hallelujah. When we're, the, when we're on the top of the mountain and we see the promised land, let's have the bravery to take some of that life, some of that mud, ourselves, our own bodies, alive mud. Amen, hallelujah. We are the mountain ways to speak directly to this local bank. This bank is our city's responsibility. If it was a local shop like it pretends to be, we would take personal responsibility for the investments that that bank makes. It is our bank. Jamie Dimon, the CEO, of Chase, who just reported in the last three months a $3.3 billion profit, he must hear our message. It must go to him and his key investors that New York City citizens are now going into his lobbies and investing their souls in a new way, investing their living mud. Amen, hallelujah. Amen. So Amen. Hallelujah. We have been to the mountaintop and we have seen the promised land. Amen, hallelujah.